guys, um, I'm probably making the biggest video I've ever made. Uh, so we've been going to Freddy Fazbear's for quite a while now, and our target was to um, prove it to you guys and to like find out um, some stuff and um, uh, see the truth of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. And um, as you guys probably know, we're now on Saturday. Um, I'm sorry if my voice is kind of messed up. I just woke up. Um, we went down Saturday and we probably found proof. Oh, we have found proof that Free Fans Bears is in fact real. But not only that, the fights of 87 is real. So you're going to want to watch this stay to the end of the whole video. And if you think this is fake, you'll change your mind. Um, if you think it's real, then you'll be really happy, so make sure you watch the end of this video, this is probably a massive video I'll ever make, the biggest video I'll ever make. So guys, I'm going to show you the clip, and then I'm going to talk about the after that, so make sure you stay to the end of the video. So, um, roll on the clip. Uh, he's on Foxy! Mm -hmm. It's like, it's like, it looks like, like some kind of old drawing of Foxy or something. Yeah. There. Oh my gosh, look at those teeth! This place is definitely five minutes of Freddy's, isn't it? I don't know, should we try and get it? I don't know, should we try and get How old is that? Look at that Coca Cola! Nutra Sweet Pie. There might be a day on it, one sec. Here we go. Something. Um, see base of camp for date. November 87, MK25, 1115. November 1987! What? That's insane! Is it? 1987. When, did, when was the bite? The bite was 19 what? 19. Wasn't it the bite of 87? Or 86? Well, that's when this place must have been closed. Look, look at the bottom. Look, it says bite. Well, not bite, it doesn't say bite, it says November something 25. November, November 87. 87. November 87. That's insane. So, guys, um, after we happen, after, when it happened, I didn't think much of it. Um, but then I looked it up, quite about 87, and I saw this. Now, when I saw this, I was like, this changed everything. Because this proves that that cat was obviously something to do with it. So I'm going to quote here, um, the day was November 7th, 1987, which as soon as I saw it, I was like, oh my god, that's it. November 1987, it was a cheerful place for parents and children alike. It was soon to be a dead and dark place on the day of November 8th, 1987. It was a birthday on that day. So it turns out, whenever it happened in November, there's a party, and I reckon that Coke can happen and took place when that party was happening because the coke can was there on November 87 and it makes you think that the coke can was there while the bite of um, 87 was happening on the party so um uh, all right kids Freddy said with his picture voice let's turn our attention to private co private code um home off up to the pri uh, pirate and let the birthday go in front so um, there's apparently the girl, uh, if you want to read the rest it'll be on the screen somewhere, but the girl is the birthday girl, and um, the birthday girl, and through the story apparently she's the one that gets killed and beaten I guess, I don't know if that's how the, I think that's how the story goes, and it makes me also think we heard a girl say, um, I'm coming to get you, Yes, uh, when we went there last, um, not yesterday, the day before, when we went there last, if you haven't heard it, it'll be, um, it'll be on, uh, can you hear it now? It looks a lot like the stage. One of them creatures. <laughs> what the f- What? Dude! Dude! Do you hear this? Are you hearing this? No, we're trapped. Oh, we need out. to get out. How do we get- Oh my god, what the f- Alright oh, guys, this has been the last of my video, um, we'll probably come back for another series, but we gotta get out. What the f- What? Dude! Dude! So guys, this is all adding up. We've got a can, 
Um, that's from 1987, from on November, which is when the party took place, which is when the bike took place, which makes me think the mechanic from the party where the bike took place. The girl in that, she's the one that gets killed first, basically, and she's the one that's been in the place with us, that's why we thought i um, hearing these noises and the sound. But um, if there's hate out there or people trying to prove it fake, um, saying we bought the Coke can, uh, there's going to be a picture on the screen now, which clearly proves that Coke can is very, that Coke can is very expensive these days, as you see here. Um, there's, a can, there's a dark Coke can that's worth $589, uh, dollars for that exact Coke can. Now, say to me, tell me why I'll spend that much money as a 15 year old kid um, on a video. Trust me, I wouldn't be able to. So, guys, this, this is ultimate proof that not, even, not only is Pretty Pie Pizza is real, but um, the Bite of 87 was real. Uh, I hope you've understood all that because I can't remember exactly if I've said everything that I need to say. Um, but this is massive. This is massive. You need to share this to everyone that knows very has their feet and stuff because we have proof it. You can't, please, haters, um, please just tell me in the comments how is it this is fake. I'd love to hear from you. Um, and tell me your thoughts, uh, everyone that's watching this, tell me your thoughts on this. Um, this is just incredible. I, I just, I'm just can't believe that we finally got massive proof. I mean, if it wasn't enough proof that he'd been there, if it wasn't enough proof that we found with the animatronic, if it wasn't enough proof that we found these girl noises and noises upstairs, I don't know what it is. Also, um, I thought when we went into the attic, you can't really see much because my light is actually dying out. But um, when we heard that girl's noise, uh, girl saying that, as you heard, um, there's an area like right at the back that looks like the stage was there. Like it was a massive hall, and that's why it's so dark. But right at the end, it was clear, no stage, but it like that's where it could have been. So um, I think I think that's I think that could be it. Though. Um, I'm gonna still go there and investigate, but this is massive. Like, I want to thank you guys for coming on the journey for me, with me and uh, Brett. Come this far and actually find proof that this is pretty bad for pizza, and we've just found so much. I just can't believe it. I mean, it's been a hell of a journey. It's been so terrifying most of the time, but it's worth it. So to show you guys the, uh, the actual truth behind pretty bad for pizza. So guys, um, I think that's gonna be it for this video. I'm, I'm gonna be. I'm not sure. I'm just, I'm not just saying, I'm not often speechless for the last like couple of well, since I found out about this. Um, so guys, thanks for watching this video. If you're new, make sure to subscribe, um, like this video if you can't believe I've actually done this, um, and comment what you think below. Uh, this is ultimate proof. If you don't think it's proof, then tell me how this is not proof. Um, and yeah, proof of three pounds of pizza and bite of 87. Like guys, I can't believe it. If that doesn't deserve a like, and that doesn't deserve a subscribe, if I subscribed already, I don't know what it does. So guys, thanks for watching. Um, I hope to see you soon. Uh, I might see you tomorrow. And yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.